everything around us is getting <laughs> curiouser and curiouser. Well, of course! Lalalu and Alice are going to Wonderland! <laughs> Once upon a time, a girl noticed a strange silhouette in the grass. A rabbit! Alice started running after it right away, without thinking about how she's going to get back home. Let's take all the old hair out of an LOL doll's head. Make a new hairstyle out of yellow light clay. Light hair will really stand out in the maze of the white rabbit. <laughs> Make a headband from a strip of foam paper. Bend a bow over a flame. Coat the legs with white acrylic paint like stockings and make them glossy with nail polish. An old doll dress looks brand new after a layer of blue paint. Try it on. Stunning! Now we just have to make a fabric apron. Fasten it on the back. Paint shoes black and put them on. Wipe off the red lipstick and create natural looking lips. Our Alice is ready to explore! <laughs> It's the White Queen's turn to make a move on the chessboard. Trim the doll's light hair. Paint the eyes dark brown. Sketch eyebrows. Make face powder by crumbling dry pastels. Make the face lighter and add blush. Paint the lips with dark lipstick. That's my favorite shade! Time to dress up our queen! Call the finest tailors! Make dress pieces from athletic fabric and sew it. Tool with glitter will make great sleeves. Make a fluffy top skirt from a satin ribbon. Bring more sparkly tool. Wow! Add puff sleeve tops made from a gathered ribbon. And some golden beads will emphasize her royal status. Snow! Bring me snow! I melt when it's hot! Create a snowflake pattern on the skirt. I will get my crown back sooner or later! And then the Red Queen will be in big trouble! Meanwhile, I'll take a walk in this wonderful pink garden! Off with their heads! Oh no! The Queen was nearby! What should we paint her face with? White acrylic paint is always a good idea! Add arched eyebrows and brown eyes! Red lipstick in the shape of a heart! Don't be stingy with the blue eyeshadow. Cut off the rubber buns. We'll make a new fiery hairstyle from felting wool. Hang on. She needs a crown. Make a collar from foam paper. Add tool sleeves. Then put on a fabric top made out of two layers of fabric. Define the shape with red acrylic paint. The skirt underneath is satin and the top skirt has a pattern. The Red Queen sure knows a lot about multi-layered outfits. Decorate the bottom with hearts. Lacy cuffs look good on this fashionista. The Red Queen has a terrible personality. She loves beheading everyone. It's a miracle that her card <laughs> guard is still safe and sound. The Queen loved playing cricket with flamingo sticks and she used hedgehogs instead of balls. This lady was very eccentric. Where did this mysterious bottle come from? I need to label it, drink me, so it doesn't get mixed up. And this red cookie says, eat me. We have a treat for our guest. Here she is. Either the well was really, really deep, or Alice was falling really, really slowly. And the poor white rabbit has to commute like this every day. Whoa! There was a door at the bottom. I wonder what these treats are. And what strange labels. Fine, I'll try it. Alice drank out of the bottle first, then ate the cookie. And something unbelievable started happening. Her body shrank down until it was so teeny tiny that she could barely escape her dress. At least the table and the door fit her. The door finally opened. What she saw took her breath away. <gasps> Alice got confused. It was nice back at home. I was always the same height there. And rabbits didn't boss me around. Why did I go in that rabbit hole in the first place? There was a mushroom in the greenery in the fog. And someone was sitting on it. Need sculpting clay and roll it. 
slightly bend it in the center. Shape a face. Smooth it out and mark out eyes. Shape the face. The expression, nose, mouth, and wrinkles. Add a couple of legs. Or more than a couple. Make folds on the body. Attach two cones and color the whole body. Add shades and folds with a dark blue color. It's so blue! And that expression! Make a pattern so it looks like the original caterpillar. Stripes and dots. Who are you? Asked the caterpillar. Ah, uh, I hardly know, sir, replied Alice timidly. I have been changed so many times since this morning, you see. I don't see, said the caterpillar strictly. Explain yourself. I'm afraid I can't explain myself, sir, because I am not myself, Alice replied. This doll's funny hair reminds us of the Mad Hatter. The truth is, we'll have to say goodbye to it anyway. Paint the face white so it looks like makeup. Ah, I can't see anything. Wow, eyes for days. Green pupils and colored eyeshadow. Alice secretly wishes she looked like this too. Paint eyelashes, lips, and his signature tooth gap. Undo part of a ribbon to make bushy eyebrows. And what's going on with the hair? This is real madness! Trim the ends. The Mad Hatter's outfit is very unique. We already sewed some pants. Let's add a shirt, a jacket with gold edging, lacy cuffs, and a huge, luxurious bow in the middle. The iconic tall hat is the only thing left. Cut parts of the hat out of cardboard. Wrap them in fabric. Tie a ribbon and add different decorations. We use feathers and pins. Welcome to the Mad Hatter's Tailor Salon. There is so much fabric, you don't even know where to look first. Sewing a new tall hat for a tea party is a big deal. Another mysterious citizen of this kingdom is the Cheshire Cat. Meow. Wipe off the lashes with nail polish remover and paint new eyes. Blue cat eyes. That's pretty rare. Add highlights and coat it with glossy nail polish. Everyone who has ever heard of the Cheshire Cat will recognize this smile. Paint the fur on the head gray. And give this legendary cat some stripes. All of a sudden, a smile started appearing in the fog that covered the forest. Then came the ears, a muzzle, eyes, and the whole cat. I just wanted to ask you which way I ought to go. Well, that depends on where you want to get to, the cat replied. Oh, it really doesn't matter, said Alice. Then it really doesn't matter which way you go, said the cat. As long as I get somewhere, Alice explained. Oh, you're sure to do that, said the cat. If you only walk long enough. <laughs> but where's the white rabbit? Paint a little toy figurine white. Only leave the pink ears and the green eyes. The rabbit was wearing a tight suit with a lacy frill and a watch he was looking at all the time and saying, The Duchess, the Duchess, she'll be furious if I'm late. That's exactly what she'll be. But the Duchess had to wait. The Mad Hatter invited everyone for the legendary tea party. It's always tea time here. We don't even have time to do the dishes. Alice, would you like a little more tea? Asked the March Hare. Well, I haven't had any yet, the girl said, offended. So I can't very well take more. Ah, you mean you can't very well take less, said the Mad Hatter. You can always take more than nothing. As the Cheshire Cat told us in secret, you are entirely bonkers. But I'll tell you a secret. All the best people are. Liking this video isn't bonkers, 
and subscribing to Lalaloo if you aren't already subscribed isn't bonkers either. Once you click on the bell, no new videos will run away from you like the white rabbit.